WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman for this 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update on Friday, last day of the week. This is March the 11th. We're looking at the Dow of 257 at 33,431. There was that rumor, I don't know if it's a rumor, there was a story about Putin, some accommodation there. Uh, but if you want to believe that, I don't know. Uh, meantime, the, the price spikes up in the futures at about 6.30 uh, or before 7 o'clock this morning. And then gave back almost everything. I'll just show you right here. Look, here it is. This is the E-mini spike in the 10-minute chart. Look at that. It has this huge move from the, around about the 42.73 level. This is a 10-minute chart. All the way to the high of 40. Um, 4335.50 and then it plunges below the 200 period moving average goes all the way down to the 4248 was it 4251 level and now it's at 4268 it needs very much to be able to get to the 4274 75 level in the e mini and then it can tackle the 4278 200 period moving average in the one minute chart once it goes above that i think you'll find more bias in the meantime back at the ranch at least there's been a consolidation um the s &P actually went negative the dow didn't go negative it's holding quite well here but really no good the dow needs to be holding i said just subscribe to my opening call dow has to be holding over 220 um, after 1.30, in fact, even to 3 o'clock, because in the last 30, 40 minutes, do you think people are going to put in brand new positions? I don't think so. Um, so just uh, that's what I'm looking at here. You're looking at the QQQ, NDX 100, a down 70 cents. Just no strength in the, in the NDX 100 vehicles. The IWM showing a little bit more strength than the other is still down 73 cents up at 199 just chart wise it's got this h pattern that goes to the m pattern trading band you've got gold it was down sharply before now it's down only 16. i think gold as a fear factor is in play uh even if it pulls back down to the 1940s i think that at some point buyers will keep coming in because it is the fear factor geopolitically so it has to be in play for a while or longer look at the um crude oil crude oil has been pulling back right now it's up again up three and eleven but it's pulled back from the um, almost 130 level in the continuous country it's 105. the big worry here i think is what what can the fed do look at the yields the yields are going up as the tlt bonds are going down what a mixed market we've got. In the meantime, you can watch the volatility index. I suspect that that's going to be the clue that the VIX index at 29.18 can go into the low 28s. The market can hold some a rally for much longer. I'll be back for the for Larry's show. Um, he's not able to do it today. I'll be back.